three changes. Number 32. Well, we've got a second half to play here, but you might well think that the first half has decided the game. You never know. But it was a very one-sided first period. Musa Dembele. Scott Parker. He's kept it out. Opportunity now. Well, why would he try the shot from there? Oh, maybe once in training he's put it in the top corner. Yeah, that was just a, a selfish act. Really, I think he's lost his head completely with that decision. Dembele. It's a real tussle between the two of them to try and get the ball. And now the shot! And he scores spectacularly. Well, he's only been on the pitch a matter of minutes. I'm not sure he's touched the ball before this, but a vital touch there to score. And he will not score a better goal than that in his entire career. He's put his foot right through it to find the bottom right corner. Another angle on it here. Losing count, it's 5-0. Here we are on EA Sports, just to tell you that the Capital One Cup fixture... Shots on here. Oh, it could have been the hat-trick for him there, and he probably deserves one too. We'd have fancied him, wouldn't you, because he's been playing ever so well, finishing well, but that was a bit of a blot. Goalkeeper, it's his ball. Musa Dembele over to Lennon. Davis Dembele Davis Federico Fazio. Kyle Walker. That's an easy interception. It's a difficult... And the goalkeeper got a touch to that. Fine save. Well, they're keeping the pressure on with all these corners. Play has stopped for a substitution. Going on the field is number 11. Well, here was a chance for him to make a real impression in the wide areas. Um, but he's being substituted now, and I think the crowd, by the sound of it, quite happy to see the back of him. Yeah. Well, I don't think his fullback will be because he had him in his pocket, but no end product from this lad today. Poor day for him. safely away Parker and he's taken the chance beautifully and 
and it's a substitute who scored. He's uh, definitely come on to try and do that, and he's made his manager very pleased. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. nil as the game is restarted Leicester City in the 64th minute number 13 Scott Parker here's a chance to move forward from midfield after that interception Walker and there is some uh, backup for him in this position Richie Delat well we will count that as a shot but it was a very poor one and a long, long way wide from a long, 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 long way out. I'm sure his manager might have a little quiet word afterwards about that decision. As for Tottenham, their next game, Alan. They're playing Watford in their next match, Martin, in the Capital One Cup, and... I think they could coast home in this one. At the moment, the pitch is bearing up under this torrential rain, which only seems to be getting worse. Well, the groundsman on the sideline will be looking a bit concerned. I mean, it is a great surface, and it does drain extremely well, so it would take a lot for this game to be called off. Well, that possibly a booking this. Good work by the goalkeeper. Missed it. Here it is again. One more time, maybe. Parker's goal. Kyle Walker. Well, they tried to keep it, but they haven't been able to do that. Crosses in. He had to clear it, even at the expense of a corner. Tries the volley. Oh, it's into the net, and it's an own goal. Caught in an awkward position, the player there. He's ended up deflecting the ball into his own net. Yeah, maybe just didn't adjust his feet quickly enough. A little clumsy. Could be a very costly own goal because they're trailing to it now. Manuel Adebayor. Anton Ferdinand. Beck. the shot it's his third goal it's a hat trick today he's really been on form oh. 
Well, no wonder he's wheeling away in a super celebration. To get a hat-trick is a fantastic experience, and he's just done that. Well, having scored two, he was just so full of confidence, and he never looked like missing that chance. Well, we're in the last few minutes now, and the die has been cast in this game, really. Federico Fazio. Goal news from Watford. It's a second goal for Southampton. It's been scored by Emmanuel Mayuka. The keeper could only parry his initial attempt, and he forced the ball home at the second time of asking. Five minutes remain. 2-0. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. Ericsson. There's a damaged muscle here. It might be a pull. He might be out for some weeks. Beck. Oh, great work by the keeper. Oh, a miss. Here's Walker. Kyle Walker. All credit to them for looking to score more goals even though they're in front. Referee right on the spot there to give the handball. Well, you're looking at a group of very confident fans. They believe their team are going to come away with the win here. And I don't think we're going to disagree with them, are we, Alan? Well, I don't think we are. And they're going through the repertoire, all their favourite songs. They can see the final whistle approaching quickly. Oh, that doesn't look too good. Probably a pulled muscle. Well, there was that attempt that we haven't really analysed, Alan. Let's look back on it now. Well, he couldn't have hit this any better. Really did strike it well from a good, good distance out. It's over, and the referee blows the whistle for the last time. They never let up, did they? They kept on going to make this a very big margin of victory. Yeah, they were ruthless, actually. Quite often, last 10 or 15, you, you ease off, but this team didn't. It was absolutely extraordinary, exceptional, elegant, excellent. Well, he goes across and grabs the match ball from the ref, a hat-trick, and that's to be treasured by any player. He's blown the whistle, and uh, the game has started. Hit the bar! And the cross is in. He's a great volley, look at that. That's deflected in by the goalkeeper. 